you've got a busted up door. So you buy a new one from Home Depot and you realize it doesn't quite fit in the hole. What do you do? Go ahead and pop your hinges off and take your door out. Go ahead and take your doorknob off. Go ahead and put your doors inside, inside, up on a flat level surface. And you can see that there's a little bit of length right there. And you can go ahead and make a mark. And also, to make sure that that mark is appropriate, we'll go ahead and measure our old door. 23 and 7 eighths. No wonder why our 24 inch door won't fit. There's an eighth of a difference. To make sure our mark is correct from earlier, let's go ahead and measure 23 and 7 eighths. We're gonna be cutting the hinge side. Let's do that. Can't forget the door. Go ahead and set up your table saw. And then after you cut, go ahead, flip the door upside down. Put the hinges lined up with the door side of the door that you just cut. And then you're gonna to wanna to take your pencil and mark the hinges so that you know where the where to make your cut. After drawing your hinge diagram or the lines for your hinges, go ahead and take your router and route them out. And then after routing out your hinges, you can go ahead and put your either your new hinges on or put the old hinges back on. Go ahead and put your door into the hole where you first started. And that's pretty much it, folks. Hey, thanks for stopping by. Subscribe, like this video, share it with a friend, and I'll see you in the next one.